no, 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 no. Oh, no. If I tell you I'm good, probably you will say I'm false. But if I tell you I'm no good, you know one line. <laughs> Yo, what's good, Boxer Talk family? It's your boy, Dr. PGNG. I'm praise God to get money back for another YouTube video. Banger, man. Yes, sir. Yes, man. I don't know what time it is. The doctor's in the house, man. So check this out. So we have some news coming from the Javante Tank Davis camp in regards to his fight with Lamont Roach. I know that a lot of people aren't looking forward to this fight. You know what I'm saying? But we do have to understand that it's a stay active fight because his other options like Lomachenko, Ryo, and De La Santos and others weren't available for, for the time, you know, uh, at the time they desired to have the fight. Now, I do understand people's frustration because it is being postponed. It's like, hey, well, if it's postponed, then, you know, why don't we have have another fight well according to reports it has been postponed to march you know like i said i know this isn't ideal because a lot of people are looking forward to seeing javante take davis back in the ring against a higher caliber more known opponent no disrespect to lamont roach um but that's just not happening you know and i know a lot of people don't want to watch the fight let me get real with y'all for a second i want to ask you a question did you watch naya anyway versus tj doheny yeah did you watch Cadello versus edgar berlanga yeah did you watch Shakur stevenson versus artem harto yeah did you watch teal Fibo versus steve claggett yeah did you watch janet beck versus andre mikhailovich who the fuck is that guy who the fuck is that no damn well who i am who the fuck is that if you answered yes to any of the aforementioned questions, I'm gonna need you to do one thing. That's shut your crybaby bitch ass up and get comfortable. Could you go watch this fight too? Damn. Motherfuckers out here capping like they ain't gonna watch the we now join our regularly scheduled program already in progress. But as I was saying, you know, if we're going to be fair, then, you know, this fight is still, while it's not the best, while it's not the most ideal, while it may not be the most intriguing, it is still a decent fight because, you know, Lamar Roach is a champion in the WBA. Is he though? Even though it is a weight class below, you know what I'm saying? So I think that, I think the, the, the people's outrage is a little bit uh, unjustified and I think it's a little ridiculous, you know, I'm not saying it's a great fight. I wasn't looking forward to Tank versus Lamar Roach and now it seems like we will have to look forward to it for march so i do understand the sentiment of people just saying find another opponent but like i said boxing upsets happen all the time it upsets you know there's there's an uh, award for upset of the year for a reason because this is boxing and, and such things happen you know nobody expected bakram mertazali to do tim zoo like that now i know they're in the same division so it's a little different but you know like i said things happen you even look at sebastian fedora how he got the two belts off of tim zoo he was a late replacement coming off of a knockout loss you know uh right before and just because circumstances happen to where we have to see these fights you know we should be understanding of that you know even with tj doheny i know initially he's supposed to fight sam goodman who he's fighting uh, uh in december but now you know in the past you know sam goodman wasn't available so he fought tj doheny and i was okay with that as a stay active fight you know we just saw Keyshawn davis fight gustavo limos who he brought down right he brought down because um his last two fights were at 140 but it was okay you know because circumstances make things a little more justified than others like i said i will re-emphasize this is not the most ideal fight or intriguing fight but i get it and lamont roach is a good fighter so i think he has a chance you know what i'm saying so i think to discount him right like you're gonna uh boycott the fight i think it's kind of disingenuous because you're gonna watch the fight you know it's javante take davis one of the most exciting fighters out there so am i looking forward to this fight in march yes i am you know would it be better if he was fighting Shakur or or Lomachenko or even Dennis Berenchek? Yes, it would. But hey, it is what it is, man. You know, and this leads the opportunity for bigger fights to be made in the summer, assuming that Javante Tate Davis actually wins because Lamont Roach is a good quality fighter. He is a champion and upsets happen in boxing. Yeah. So y'all let me know what y'all think about that in the comments. Am I being a little too lenient? Am I being a little bit too understanding? Let me know who would you rather see him fight. Matter of fact, we know who you would rather see him fight. Let me know if you're going to actually... Uh, uh, hold your own feet to the fire be accountable and not just be wolfing and actually boycott the fight because if you don't want to watch it you disapprove of it i mean that's the natural logical you know procedure to take you know and that's that's a boycott the fight you know but i don't think you'll do it i'm not going to do it and i'm gonna, i'm looking forward to it actually because i think lamont roach has a good chance you know i appreciate y'all rocking with me as always remember with god we can do anything without god we're nothing the doctor's out peace don't forget to like the video i know you mad because i was talking to you earlier i was just joking stay blessed from the hood to college, both worlds they had to meet. Six degrees between us, so cold we're about to freeze. But we're Florida boys, hot takes, we bring the heat. We're moving the culture, the engineers to the streets.